At six, Senate Bill 157 introduced in Frankfurt last week. It's a bill that would allow the sale of puppy and kitten mill animals in pet stores. Now our Ramey Cohen spoke with advocates about the impacts that this bill could have on those without a voice. Anita Spritzer with Pause for the Cause says if Senate Bill 157 passes, more animals will continue to die. And this year we have seen thousands and thousands of dogs die in high kill shelters because of the fact that rescues are working so hard with the animals that are being dumped in rural areas right now. And most of those dogs are from puppy mills. SB 157 would overturn existing ordinances in Elizabethtown, Radcliffe, and Louisville that stops the sale of puppies or kittens from breeding facilities. This bill would also prevent additional ordinances from being enacted. Spritzer, the vice president for Pause for the Cause, says bills like this have been defeated all across the country. You need to let your representatives know enough is enough. The animals of Kentucky have suffered enough and something's got to give and the laws need to change. Todd Blevins is the Kentucky State Director for the Humane Society of the United States. Both advocates say Petland, an international pet store chain, is pushing to get this bill passed. Know that the pet stores that sell puppies are sourcing them from puppy mills. They're not getting them from your local mom and pop breeder or from shelters and rescue if they're selling them. Petland has a store in Lexington and Spritzer says Petland is looking to open a big store in Louisville. Currently hundreds of puppies are in shelters. Because there's nowhere for them to go right now. There's so many animals out there right now. Think about our local shelters and rescues. They already have an influx of animals as it is. It's code red for lots of shelters and rescues out there, and this will only make the problem worse. This bill comes after Lexington Council members announced plans to introduce an ordinance to ban the sale of dogs and cats in pet stores. If you oppose this bill, we'll have the number you can call in this story at WTVQ.com. In Lexington, Remy Cohen, ABC 36 News.